okay so let's look at a question here on diode transistor logic you will get much more clarity so i have taken two diode arrangement here <clears throat> so this is uh, let's say d3 and d4 okay so 5 volt 5 kilo ohm 2 kilo ohm this is a transistor let me call it as q1 and 5 kilo ohm resistor this is serving the uh, the application of that sucking the charge of from the base uh, that helps in switching faster switching and d1 d2 is there a and b here you are applying the voltages now some quantities are given to you uh, for example diode on voltage is 0.7 volt uh, vbe saturation is 0.7 volt this vbe in saturation when the transistor q1 will be in saturation your vbe will be 0.7 volt and vc will be 0.2 volt you have to calculate the power dissipation okay power dissipated by this circuit whenever you have to uh, so I, i'm solving now so whenever you have to think of power dissipation you have to think of two terms supply voltage and supply current how much supply voltage it is connected to and how much supply current it is drawing overall okay so this is the supply voltage 5 volt right vcc is 5 volt and we have to calculate icc and the product of this will give you the power dissipation now icc is what current it is the supply current overall circuit how much it is drawing so i can write here icc right this is something we have to calculate now if you remember icc is is average of ICCH plus ICCL divided by 2 right so this is the supply current when the output is high supply current when the output is low so we have to calculate these two quantities taking the average of it will give you ICC if you multiply this with VCC you will get the power dissipation now how you gonna calculate ICCH and ICCL that is what I'll be telling you here is first I am calculating I C C uh, H okay ICCH is when your output is high this output okay high output now uh, if this guy will be high means this Q1 transistor might be in uh, will be in uh, cutoff right then and then only this 5 volt will appear here and you will call it as high output if this is uh, cut off, in cutoff means you are not drawing any current here means one of the input is logic low right so how you gonna proceed how you gonna calculate you want this current in the case when output is high how you gonna calculate you have a current here flowing in 5 kilo ohm and you have a current flowing in 2 kilo ohm let me call this current as iy because it is flowing in y direction and let me call this current is ir since it is flowing through a resistor okay so how you gonna calculate these two currents just apply kvl so uh, so if you have high output here means this guy is in cutoff means there won't be any current here right directly you can write i y is equal to zero right cutoff region it is there won't be any base current or collector current so automatically i y becomes zero now you just have to calculate the i r how you know calculate the i r so you you what you do is you you provide the path here like this so any of the input or both of the input is 0 0 0 0 1 or 1 0 this same will be the circuit okay so 5 volt to any of this you will apply kvl so minus 5 volt here there won't be any current 5 kilo ohm i am calculating ir plus 0 0.7 i am taking that uh, input is uh, 10 so this will be open and this will be closed or you you can also take 00, zero. Uh, so if you will have 00, zero both will be shorted and both will produce same voltage here so that is 0 0.7 plus 0 0.2 0 0.7 plus 0 0.2 i am taking logic low here as 0 0.2 volt okay now you can calculate ir from here ir will be 
फाइव माइनस जीरो पॉइंट सेवन माइनस जीरो पॉइंट टू डिवाइड बाय फाइव किलो ओम दैट विल गिव यू जीरो पॉइंट एट टू मिली एम्पियर ओके और विल राइट हियर जीरो पॉइंट एट टू मिली एम्पियर राइट एंड आई आर इज एनी वे आई वाई आई वाई इज एनी वे जीरो आई आर इज जीरो पॉइंट एट टू मिली एम्पियर सो यू कैन राइट आई सी सी एच इज इक्वल टू आई वाई प्लस आई आर दैट विल गिव यू जीरो प्लस जीरो पॉइंट एट टू दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट एट टू मिली एम्पियर ओके सो यू हैव कैलकुलेटेड आई सी सी एच नाउ आई विल बी कैलकुलेटिंग आई सी सी एल ओके सो लेट मी राइट समवेयर दैट आई सी सी एच इज जीरो पॉइंट एट टू मिली एम्पियर राइट नाउ आई विल बी कैलकुलेटिंग आई सी सी एल वेन द आउटपुट इज जीरो सो वॉट विल हैपन अगेन यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट दीज गाइज नाउ इफ द आउटपुट इज जीरो मीन्स इट इज कनेक्टेड लाइक दिस सो योर क्यू वन ट्रांजिस्टर इज इन सैचुरेशन मीन्स इट इज ड्रॉइंग करेंट फ्रॉम हियर एज वेल एज हियर सो बोथ विल बी फाइनाइट वैल्यूज हियर देयर वॉन्ट बी एनी करेंट ड्रॉन ओके यू कैन अप्लाई अ के वी एल लाइक दिस लाइक दिस from this 5 volt to this ground okay so i can write minus 5 volt plus 5 kilo ohm ir plus 0.7 for this 0.7 for this so 0.7 plus 0.7 plus vb in saturation cases also 0.7 right that is equal to 0 if you calculate you will get ir this is the only term uh, it is unknown so if you'll calculate uh, what will be the ir you will be getting this is uh, 2.1 5 minus 2.1 divided by 5k that is 0.58 milliampere right if you'll solve this so you have ir now you can calculate the iy so you have you can apply kvl like this you have vc saturation here Uh, the drop across this you have to calculate you are already aware of 5 volt let me apply 5 volt plus 2k iy plus vc is 0.2 volt that is equal to 0 so from this 5 volt to this ground i have came like this okay so from here iy you can calculate 5 minus 0.2 divided by 2k that will be 2.4 milliampere now you have both the current so i c c l will be 0.58 पॉइंट फाइव एट प्लस टू पॉइंट फोर मिली एम्पियर दैट विल गिव यू हाउ मच टू पॉइंट नाइन एट मिली एम्पियर यू हैव नाउ आई सी सी एल यू हैव आई सी सी एच नाउ आई विल कैलकुलेट द आई सी सी एवरेज ओके सो आई सी सी एवरेज विल बी इक्वल टू दिस गाय जीरो पॉइंट एट टू प्लस दिस गाय 2.98 पॉइंट नाइन एट डिवाइड बाय टू दैट विल गिव यू वन पॉइंट नाइन एट मिली एम्पियर ओके नाउ यू हैव आई सी सी एवरेज यू हैव वी सी सी इज इक्वल टू फाइव वर्ल्ड टेक द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ इट दैट इज आई सी सी एवरेज इन टू वी सी सी दैट विल गिव यू वॉट दैट विल गिव यू द पावर डिसिपेशन नाइन एट मिली एम्पियर इन टू फाइव That will give you around 9.9 milliwatt. Okay, 8 to 9 milliwatt. That's the power dissipation usually in diode transistor logic. Okay, so this is your answer, and you might have got the feel how to solve this kind of circuit. Okay, so this is one example. Much more confident you might be feeling now. So this is the approach you have to follow. Okay, so this was uh, uh, diode uh, uh, diode transistor logic. now i'll be moving to its next variant which is called high threshold uh, logic which is exactly similar to this circuit uh, it's a variant of diode transistor logic only operation wise also it is similar just with some um, tweaks okay and we will uh, see what characteristics we'll get better there